if you want your game to go from looking like this to this, you're in the right spot. What is up everybody? My name is B Milton. Welcome to the video. Today we're going to go over the best Nvidia GeForce Experience game filter settings for Marvel Rivals. And yeah, that was a lot to say, but the process is very easy, so let's get into it. But right before we do, just have to say that I am a creator that doesn't put ads like War Thunder in my video. So if this helps you at all, just leave me a like, man. It helps me a lot. So hit Alt Z on your keyboard. It'll bring up this game filter experience. On the left hand side, you'll see game filters and it also teaches you. You can just hit Alt F3 next time. And then you will see uh, if I click none here, it will show you what your game will default look like without any game filters on it. And then you'll have three boxes. You want to select the first one uh, or any one preset you want to make. On the left hand side, there's a bunch of different game filters. You want to click on the three that I have color, details, brightness and contrast. And then we will go through this uh, in just in a second. But I want to say if you're somebody who's here just to copy the settings that I have, I'll put them in the description below or in the pinned top comment. Um, because I know some people just want to copy it, but for everyone else, I'm going to explain why these settings are what they are. Yeah. And then you can also switch them or change them, tweak them a little bit to your liking. But in my opinion, I found some really good settings. So start with color. You're going to go down here and tint color zero because you don't want any tint on your game. Tint intensity, obviously zero temperature zero, because yet again, it's like a tint. It's going to change your color your screen to be blue or, or red or whatever vibrance i only have up to 16. this is because if you go up here some people think this looks good but i don't think it looks very good and it's also going to strain your eyes the more bright really bright colors um especially in a game like this that's fast paced it's going to hurt your eyes so i keep it down here to 16. another thing going through these settings um i make a lot of these videos for different games marvel rivals is actually a very well created game um the way that the uh, colors are the sharpness of the game everything right out of the box the preset that just comes uh, when you download the game is actually pretty decent in this game so some of these uh, we're not going to change as much as I do for other games coming down here to details sharpen you want to leave at zero percent because if you want to sharpen your game I suggest that you do that inside of your game I'll put up on the screen now a way that you would be able to sharpen your, your screen uh, inside of your game I would rather do that inside of the game instead of on top of the game now going down the clarity i have to 42 this is kind of a a form of sharpening as well uh to be honest with you but if you see in the distance the rocks the top right hand side of the screen if i go too high it's going to be a little bit too sharp and if i go down uh, i think i had around 30 something just around 30 is fine in my opinion i found by going up and down uh you can do this yourself you can see right when the stuff like very far away like the rocks and the trees start to pop a little bit and you want to just to add just a tiny bit of sharpness on the stuff that's really far away uh, that's why i have it where it is hdr tone mapping if you go too far to the right yet again it's going to be a little bit too bright so i have it down here um, around 16. bloom you never want to add that because look at it's just going to create white on your screen for no reason don't do that um, and then brightness and contrast Exposure I have the 16 um, because yet again if you go too low the the stuff like the shadows and stuff is going to be really hard to see so I have it around hovering around 16 if you go too far right on the exposure yet again it's going to make your screen too bright and white contrast I have 36 they, these are all kind of the same I just move these sliders up and down until I see that there's still some things in the game like if it go too far to the right yet again it's going to bring up too much um, contrast where darks are going to be too dark and in a fast-paced game like this you want to be able to see stuff so i'm going to go back down here around 30 something um and yet again it's because you don't want the darks to be too dark you don't want your eyes to strain too much highlights the same thing 30 something uh you go to the right this doesn't really do a whole lot like as you can see if i'm moving it up and down you could get away with going a little bit higher maybe but i just want to keep it around 30 something as well shadows this is something that i really was struggling with because um yet again i like to have a little bit of shadows to add a little bit of realism to the game um so i was kept it at two but as you can see even if i go up to 10 if i go up to 10 if you look at the shadow on the right hand side of the screen it's kind of dark it does make things look a little bit more realistic and it looks good but in a fast-paced game like this you would rather it be minimal 
so we're gonna go to two all right guys well there you have it those are my personal game filter settings for the game marvel rivals and if you think there's anything that you would change or you've been playing around with and you think is better just put it in the comment section below and then maybe somebody will read it and agree with you and maybe they'll try it out and come back and uh say what they think about it and lastly i do need to add what you're seeing on screen might not exactly look like it looks on my screen this is because i've been having trouble uh with the software obs to record this video for some reason on um desktop capture i am having a trouble recording my screen because i'm using hdr and obs doesn't like hdr so just also remind yourself that exactly what you're seeing on your screen while you're watching this video on youtube might not exactly be how my screen looks i think my screen looks really good um, but it might not be completely captured over to this video so you can't exactly see uh, what it looks like until you put the settings in your game yourself and then see on your own screen uh, what it looks like so try it out let me know how it goes uh, enjoy your games hopefully you have some good games of marvel rivals the game is awesome um, and i'll see you guys in the next one if you haven't subscribed yet please do leave a like if this helped you and i'll see you guys in the next one peace